Hi everyone, welcome back to channel Tech and Art. Hope you guys doing good. Today we will discuss about one of the compliance issue. So please watch the complete video. In the video we will discuss lot of things. Okay. And whoever newly join our channel, please like to subscribe. Don't forget to share with others. Uh, please visit the channel playlist SQL Server DBA. More than 250 videos which can help you day to day activities. And recently I have enabled the member so you can join as a channel as a member. Okay. And whoever want to contribute YouTube thanks that's also you can uh, do it okay so let me start so uh, before starting uh, firstly we'll give some kind of background okay so in every projects we have uh, to remediate the compliance issue okay uh, because you know uh, it's a very critical to you know uh, if any environment is running with compliance that's very risky okay so one of the compliance is like you know uh, unauthorized uh, service account uh, which is you know granted access on a particular SQL server instance that is very very risky okay so uh, let's say assume uh, you have a very huge big environment okay and uh, if you were you know uh, going to fetch the record for particular instance uh, of how many service account is there and what kind of permissions and what are the services running based uh, with that service account whether it's a uh, you know authorized or not based on your environment uh, uh, sop okay so uh, basically uh, for that in that case it's very uh, difficult to pull the records lot of automation tools already there a lot of script also you can use so one of the script i am going to discuss with you guys i will give this a script in description it's a very simple straightforward let's say uh, uh, you have a particular instance lab 01 <coughs> and that instance having the compliance issue uh, you need to fit the, all the service account details okay so this uh, script will give you the nice information okay uh, if you can see the first column it's giving the service you know a name the uh, the startup type the last startup time also it's giving okay and the service account and the the file name also giving you know the process ID and so this is very very helpful to fetch the details uh, if you have n number of like uh, like a uh, 500 uh, you know uh, particular logins from on a particular instance and lot of service account is there so you need to be very careful with service account whether that particular service account is authorized or not whether the sql and any services is running on authorized service account or not so this script basically help you to fetch the records you can track it in excel and go with the analysis you can uh, directly copy with header and put it in excel and this based on that you can match your uh, you know uh, approved sop and uh, based on that you can remediate it if any service is running with unauthorized service account you can uh, right away do the process whatever the change process and uh, do the remediation so it's a very small help but it's very very critical if you are working on a compliance issue okay this is very helpful actually i will put this script in the description you can utilize it so that uh, today's that's for the short video but it's very helpful hope you got the point of what i'm trying to convey the message okay we'll meet you soon uh, very soon with the another lab okay till then bye bye thank you and keep watching keep sharing also thank you guys